Okay, so we are no longer in the nether um, because of my unfortunate demise. Can I eat a magma cream? No. Blueberries. And maybe some of this other crap. I have 20 soul sand. That's plenty. Do I have, did I put some soul sand in my backpack? I've got all sorts of nether crap in my backpack. Alright, so I think what we should do now since uh, you know what? First, we need to. We, we should. We should sleep. My daughter is fighting her nap. Shock. I know. <sighs> All right. Let's upgrade this sword a bit more. Sword. Oh wait, I forgot to take the. Ah! What the heck? <laughs> That's funny. I did not intend to do that. Alright. So, we'll do blocks of quartz. Increase sharpness. 3.5 hearts. I think once this is full, it'll, yeah, it'll do 4 hearts worth of damage. Um. I have so many gold, so much gold and diamonds. I think I'm going to give it an additional modifier and make it even sharper. <laughs> additional modifier. What? Well, then, what does that only work? I haven't used. I haven't done that to this yet, have I? I swear I haven't. Is it just diamonds? Oh, this is gold block. And diamond. Just maybe I've already done it, so it won't let me do it. <laughs> that's funny. Huh. Oh well, that's fine. It does plenty of damage. I need more... Do I have any spider's eyes? I went through that whole ordeal, no spider's eyes. I can make some more consecrated soil at least. So let's see, what is that? That's... Bone meal. Do we have any brains in here? Because I know it's brains. And dirt. Dirt blocks. Dirt blocks. So it's bone meal, brains, dirt blocks. Graveyard soil. Bone meal. Or oh, hold on to the dirt. Ah! Fell down my steps. Start cooking this. Alright, while that's cooking, I guess I should probably show you guys around the place. So this is the crafting area up here in my attic area zone. A massive smeltery. It looks like a big old smokestack outside or chimney stack outside, which is nice. I've got all my Tinker's Construct necessities over here. I've got my basic setup over here. This is my trash can. <laughs> I put stuff I don't really need in there. Um, my smeltery setup, on the one side I have a mass pour out, so I can do three blocks at once out of that spout. A big pour, which I can do single blocks out of there, and then the casting table pours right out of there. Should be nice. Let's uh, change that. Nope. Nope. Turn that down. There we go. Alright. So that is what's in here. Hold up one second. Whoop. There we are. Alright. And this is where I live. Out here in the islands. It's lovely. Look at this view. Lovely ocean view. There's a pirate ship over there. There's no pirates in it anymore. I killed them all. And then... I've got my house. Like I said, I'm still kind of... I got a lot of basic stuff done, pretty much, before recording, because, I, you know, some of that stuff... Honestly, I mean, sometimes it can be fun to watch if there's really funny commentary and stuff between a group of people just mining and dicking around and stuff and building houses and surviving the first night and whatever, but it's uh, it's been done time and time again. Um, and I like Hexit. So some of that stuff can be painstaking, like putting that big of a fern putting that big of a smeltery together takes a long, long time, long time. So I think it looks nice. 
but I've got some, I found some soccer wood trees when I went out. I actually, I found them over by where my slot, my sli bleh bleh bleh, slime island is. And I got some slime trees for when I need slime crystals. I got regular trees that are just still growing here that I haven't cut down. And I got all these blueberries, because they're delicious. And nutritious. And they're good for you, too. Arrow. Is that a beaver? Yes. Yes, it is. Oh, hex it. So, I'm thinking about doing some stuff over here. I don't know. I'm thinking about maybe leveling this out and making it more of like a farm set up for the bushes and whatever. And then I'm thinking over there on that sandy island about making like a cool, um, like warehouse vault thing. Mm. So we'll look into that. Um, I have no plans of going into chocobo breeding. Um, it appears to be just as much of a pain in the ass in Minecraft as it was in Final Fantasy. So, if not, potentially more so. Yeah, we'll see about this area over here. I think I'm going to keep this area just kind of naturally bleh. <coughs> I turned that little sand island into a sugarcane growing area. Actually, I should gather so up some of that stuff. Oop, I might have squished my wheat. Nope, okay. I'm going to gather this up. some cotton plants growing over here as well and some wheat because I don't really need the cotton anymore though because I stole a whole bunch off of a pirate ship sail so that's what's over on that side of the island and if you come over here <laughs> nom, 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 nom. yum berries we've got my staircase into the sky no it's a staircase to a slime island um, I haven't readily decided whether I'm going to like decorate it up and make it look nice and stuff. Uh, if that's something you want to see, just, you know, leave a comment below and I'll do that. If it's something you think I should do off camera, well, screw you then. And maybe I will. <laughs> I might not. I don't know. Still haven't decided. Back here is the entrance to my mine, directly under my house. Because there is just a natural little... I just decided to start digging out underneath here, and there's, it goes pretty deep, I figured this was a good spot, and I split it, going two ways, so that ends up in a big, big cave system, where I've been able to find lots and lots of stuff, and that goes all the way down to bedrock, where there's lots of basalt, and I can make these nice black bricks that look very good, and I have found loads of diamonds and stuff very easily down here, um, if you want the seed for this world, just, you know, pop a thing down in the comment section and I will give it to you. Sound good? Sound good. And that's, I mean, that's primarily what's over there. That's just up to a slime island. It was kind of a pain in the butt to do that. This is my magic tower, hut, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. Um, it is mostly incomplete not really furnished at all. Um, I have ideas of what I'm going to do. I'm going to put some enchanting stuff in here. Potion making stuff in here. <laughs> my daughter is being silly. And up here is where we have my portals. So, we can always go back to the nether. And I did this even though I don't know when or if I'm going into the twilight forest before I finished building the house because when you make it, lightning strikes the water in here and it turns it into the portal so it's kind of important to have I wanted it I kind of wanted it inside so I, but I had to make it before I finished the roof or else risk you know fire so 
I think we need to sort out my inventory crap real quick. That's what I want to do. And then we can do some stuff here at home base for a little bit.